Good evening. This is This Week Tonight with John Irvin. And tonight I've got Pauline Cronin and her daughter, Anna. And Pauline is from the Nantucket Community School. Pauline, tell us a little bit about why we have the community school. So the community school is here on Nantucket to provide um, enriching programs. We want to engage the whole community, providing them for affordable programs so that we can enrich the lives of all islanders. Okay, and you guys are located on 56 Center Street, aren't you? Well, we're lucky, we have two locations. Where's so the we're, other? We're at 56 Center Street and we're also at 128 Old South Road. Okay, is that essentially the school? That's where we have our, our no, we have our early childhood center out there and we also have admin offices and a registration office. Okay, now uh, tell me what all is going on with the early childhood development. So the early childhood programs are just getting revved up for their fall programming. Um, we have registration coming this Saturday at 9 o'clock at the 128 Old South Road uh, location. Um, it, we start registration at 9 o'clock. Our brochure actually comes out in the newspaper tomorrow, but you can also find it online at the Inquirer and Mirror, and it's posted on our website. So you can find out all the different programs we have to register for. We also have programs that you don't have to register. We understand people are busy and they might not be able to commit to a 12-week program. So we have drop-in times at the Early Childhood Center. We also have drop-in programs at 56 Center Street, including um, one, a new one called Mother Woman that I'm going to be co-facilitating with Sunny Daly. Oh, that sounds exciting. Now tell me a little bit about Mother Woman. So Mother Woman is um, it's a group for moms to um, get together, to talk, and to feel empowered in the position that they're playing as a mother in their children's lives. So that would probably be good, especially for new mothers. New mothers, um, all of our programs are for uh, children birth through eight. We try and capture parents before they've even had their children to let them know about our programs. So mothers with children of all ages. Terrific. Now, what else is going on? at the Nantucket Community School? Uh, the, well, it's not just early childhood, as you know, so we also have um, the community pool, and they are running, um, one of their new programs is the Adult Learn to Swim. We know there's lots of adults out there who might not be able to swim, aren't confident swimmers, but there's a program coming up for them. So, so living on an island, that would be important to know how to swim. Very important. <laughs> so um, great people running that program, help people feel confident in the water. Um, and build their skills. That's terrific. Now, I, I know that uh, the Nantucket Community School isn't just for kids, as you mentioned. There are all, also programs for adults. Uh, what else is going on down there? Or what's a good way to find out what is all going on down there? So you can find out by going to um, nantucketcommunityschool.org is our webpage, or you can drop into our office locations, pick up a brochure or find the brochure online. Cheryl Reichman is our new adult ed coordinator. Um, she's gonna be able to do some great things for adult ed on the island. I've, I've met Cheryl and she's a dynamic person. Yes, very yeah. much so. Um, some other programs, we have after school enrichment programs. We um, collaborate with Sustainable Nantucket. There's a garden program. The uh, teen programs are doing a new tech program and robotics. They're doing tennis. Wow. Um, I don't want to miss anything out. There's a babysitting workshop that comes up. Um, That's important. It's always very, very popular, so you sign up as soon as it comes out. Um, I'm trying to think of anything else. The, uh, something else I do want to think about when we're thinking about all generations is that we have a, a support group for grandparents aunts, uncles who are raising their grandchildren or a child that might be in their care. So we have a great group with Susan Richards to help those people get together, connect, and Terrific. find resources. And um, why don't you remind us what the website is? The website is www.nantucketcommunityschool.org. Very good. Pauline Cronin, thank you very much. Thank you very much.